Meet Triceratops, one of the most famous dinosaurs. Its name tells you exactly what it looks like. Tri means three, Cirrit means horn, and Ops means face. So Triceratops literally means three-horned face. They are known for their three horns and a giant frill. Two long horns grew above its eyes, with a shorter one on its nose. Behind them was a huge bony shield called a frill. It was like a built-in crown and a protective shield all in one. These dinosaurs were huge. A full-grown Triceratops was as long as a school bus and weighed as much as two big elephants. Imagine a creature that big walking down your street. It would have made the ground shake. Did you know there were different species like Triceratops horridus and Triceratops porcus? They were part of the same dino family but had cool little differences, like the shape of their horns and frills. So what did these giants eat? Triceratops were herbivores, meaning they only ate plants. They used their strong, sharp beak, like a parrot's, to snip off tough ferns. Then, hundreds of teeth in the back of their mouths would slice and grind the plants into a mushy meal. Living with predators like the mighty Tyrannosaurus rex meant Triceratops had to be ready to defend itself. That giant frill made its head look bigger and more intimidating. If a T-Rex got too close, Triceratops could stand its ground and charge with its powerful horns. Paleontologists have even found T-Rex bones with healed puncture marks that perfectly match a Triceratops horn. They probably didn't face these dangers alone. Scientists believe Triceratops lived and traveled in herds, just like elephants do today. There's safety in numbers. When resting, they likely gathered in groups, but were always on alert, taking short naps to stay watchful. Their horns and frills weren't just for fighting. Males may have used them to show off to females, proving they were strong and healthy. They might have had gentle shoving matches, and that frill? It could have flushed with bright colors, like a giant billboard, to communicate with other Triceratops. Triceratops roamed the forests of ancient North America about 68 to 66 million years ago. This was during the very end of the late Cretaceous period. They were one of the last great dinosaurs to exist before a giant asteroid hit the Earth, changing the world forever. We know all of this thanks to paleontologists. They find Triceratops fossils mostly in North America, in states like Montana, South Dakota, and Wyoming. They carefully dig up the bones and piece them together like a giant 3D puzzle, helping us tell their incredible story. So, to recap, Triceratops means three-horned face. It was as big as a bus, used its horns for defense, and lived in herds right at the end of the age of dinosaurs. What an awesome animal. Want to learn more fun facts? Make sure you subscribe to Getter Done Kids TV so you don't miss a thing.